Good morning folks and welcome to Jag Lives. All right folks, now I've been up since seven o'clock this morning doing the washing, yes. Changed the bed last night and I just got up at seven o'clock and stuck the washing in the washing machine. It's now about half past eight, nine o'clock and I'm gonna be hanging the washing out. Crikey, the grass is getting long, man. Right, here we go. It's a lovely morning. Must say, the grass is soaking wet like, but don't know what to do today. Bro's back from Tenerife. Don't know whether to give him a call or just chill out on my own today. Um, we'll see. Right, folks, it's quarter to ten, so I've made myself get up and get out. Enjoy this glorious day. Today I'm going to try and head down onto a Barry Budden beach now. They normally have shooting down there for the cadets and I don't know if I'll be able to get onto the beach. Sometimes you can, just depends what's going on. But it's meant to be a nice beach down there, untouched by humans, similarly. So we'll head down that way anyway and see what we can find. Bro, I've tried to get in touch with him today, but he seems to be incommunicado. I tried messaging him and phoning him, but just nothing. So I hope he's okay. He's probably just knackered from his exhausting Tenerife trip. So, off we go folks, come with me, thank you. As always, do like the video, and here we go. Right folks, we've arrived here at Barry Links Station, one of the ghost stations of Scotland. has hardly ever used this station, but I've got here, and there's a train about to come. So, there's a few dog walkers here, as well, so maybe, oh mind you look, the red lights flashing over there, so I don't think I'm gonna be able to get down onto the beach today, folks. Oh, here comes the train, folks. One of my favorite things, scary things, is to stand on a bridge while a train goes hurtling beneath. Here it comes. It's way in the distance. Getting closer. Oh, here it, oh, here it comes, oh! There it goes. Um, somebody tried to phone me there. I don't know who that was. Hang on. Right, we'll go through here. Let's see where this takes us. Right, I, I don't know where I've come out at here, folks. I'd like to walk down this way. I don't know. Marching troops have priority. So I don't know if I'm supposed to walk down there or not, because the same road seems to go down this way, so we're going to head sort of down that way anyway and see what's occurring down here. This is the big practice ground, obviously, for the Lynx Carnoustie course, just right over there behind me. Right, I can hear some firing away in the distance there. So this is the reason you're not really supposed to be down here in case you get a wayward bullet comes flying across strikes in the head or something like that anyway so but I can't see how a wayward bullet is gonna come way over here somehow but anyway we'll carry on walking folks well I think we're on the golf course now are we yes yeah, nice pond look at these marsh reeds excellent Wow, there's another pond appeared. Look at this wonderful little nature area. It's a hide over there as well. I can see it over there. My goodness, the noise of different bird song, man. I've never heard these sounds. It's just a cacophony of different chirps and burrs and whistles and pleeps and chooks and all sorts of excellent noises man wow brilliant little place down here man we can hear more firing folks and the red flag is flying that means they're shooting the highland cows the 
path goes on. I'm actually a little bit lost now folks. I think I might have to retrace my steps, but I've come under this tree here to get some shade. Would you believe it? Shade. It's absolutely roasted, man. It's glorious. Mind you, probably doesn't help. I've got a thermal t-shirt on and uh, the big heavy weird fish thing on. So there's quite a few golfers about here, so I better be quiet. Shh. Well, that was a bit of a fail there. Couldn't get into the Barry Button area. Never mind. Just thinking, did I have a hat on? Have I lost my hat? I'll check back in the other videos to see, but uh, I think I had my hat on, didn't I? Oh. Anyway, that's the first part of today's stroll adventure over. Let's see what else we can do now. I don't know what this is, folks. I'm at the Kinloch Care Centre, 1995. See if it dings. Oh, it certainly does, man. It was a good one. Nice one. Oops. <laughs> the residents are waking up. Golf Street, folks. Golf Street. Now, a moment ago there, I was actually driving down Golf Street. Driving down Golf Street. See what I did there? Drive whack. Yes. It'd be quite interesting, actually, if you had a, a tee just there. You'd see if you could drive the length. So we're heading down now, we're heading down Golf Street and we're going to be heading in towards the Carnoustie Lynx course shortly. Well not the Lynx course, the championship course I think it is. Golf Street. And the station's actually called Golf Street Station as well. Oh, that's the Burnside Golf Course. You can see the stands they're building here for the for the open which comes to Carnoustie shortly. Alright folks, well, I've come down here to the uh, Carnoustie Championship course here and we're going to sit and have a coffee and chill for half an hour. Tennis, football, skater hockey. Wow, skater hockey.
so there we go very nice coffee there always enjoy my coffee there good solid eight out of ten and i got a free biscuit a little shortbread thing as well fantastic so i was just corresponding with bro there just gonna send him a few texts and messages and things so i don't think we're going to meet up today because he's too knackered and i'm got to get home and look after rosie really so but we will be going out again at the weekend so i think that's my adventure over with folks for the day i have to get home now and as i said look after rosie and do a bit of um sort of house maintenance and chores and things anyway we'll see what happens later on folks so until then i will bid you farewell and i will see you sooner than you think oh no folks it started to rain and my washing's hanging out dilemma time i'm here at tesco doing a big shop do i abandon that and rush home to get the washing in or do i just stay here and get the shopping in and hope the rain stays off <gasps> dilemma time see if it dings oh, it certainly does man